probably the most pain I've felt in a very, very long time. It's frustrating, but we'll see what we can do. Here comes the, here comes the, here comes the, y'all don't really worry like Isn't that so hard putting the weight on the bar? It's because of the bar. Like, look at, look at the bend right there. Hope you guys can see it, but. What is going on, guys? Summer Flex Episode 7. For all of you participating, hopefully you're killing it. Um, this is our chest and shoulder focus workout, but we started off with deadlifts. That's the way we've been doing it, and that is part of the Summer Flex routine. Um, just a heads up, if you are not participating in it, it is still not too late. Go join the Facebook group. It's down in the uh, description below, the link. Um, so, kind of when I was sitting down and putting this video together, seeing what we came up with for the week, um, I was kind of hesitant to putting this out. And the main reason is because we told you guys at the start of Summer Flex that we we're gonna make sure that every video is an absolute banger. We're not gonna put it out if there's crappy content or if it's not the best of our ability, the best that we can possibly do. Um, and lately, you know, the Summer Flex episodes, I feel like we've been getting a lot of love for it. Um, the edits, you know, we've been putting a lot of time and effort into it, making sure that we have a sick song and, um, you know, even by giving it all these all awesome tips, like trying to help you guys out, doing something cool like biking or cliff jumping or, you know, just water basketball. Like, it's been a lot of fun, but I just feel like I haven't really sat down and actually talked to you guys, you know, vented and ranted and, you know, just talked about life and progress and stuff. So decided to just toss in these clips. You guys can also watch me talking at the same time. So, um, yeah, the mentality for all our videos is just always the best content possible, but I think sometimes it's nice to even just talk about progress and, and stuff like that. So that's what I'm doing here. You guys can watch us doing our workouts. Um, here we're doing some back offsets and uh, you guys have seen us bench press. You've seen us deadlift. You've seen us squat. You guys know how much we can lift, but um, yeah, so here I just wanted to talk a little bit about what we've been up to lately and the main focus has been Colossus Coaching. We have had a lot of signups. So this past week we've had a ton of Skype calls. Um, you know, we've been putting together some customized routines, uh, you know, macronutrient intakes. We've been doing all that stuff. So it's been really good. We had a sale going on and we had a bunch of people take advantage. We chose um, five lucky guys and girls and or girls who were to be a part of Colossus Coaching. So that's going really well. Um, Aside from that, I just wanted to talk about progress. So, Summer Flex, um, the goal for Josh and myself has been to lose weight, and I know a lot of you guys are trying to lose weight as well. So, I started at 172 pounds. Now, I'm down to 167, so I've lost five pounds, but the issue is I haven't been progressing as much as I wanted. And my goal as a YouTuber and a coach, and I know the same as Josh, is to be absolutely transparent you know, if I'm having a bad day or if I mess up or something like that, just to let you guys know that it happens and to be realistic with you guys. So um, basically the issue is I was simply going over my macros. So they were 2,500 calories, but um, you know, I had a bunch of reasons. And, and the thing is I accepted it. I said, okay, I went over uh, my mistake. You know, I had a few reasons. I went out for a couple of drinks with my buddy who just came back from Australia from, you know, being there for seven months. And it's summer, I'm living life. And you know, that's the way it should be lived. But I, uh, I accepted that and right now I'm moving on. But the reason I'm bringing this up is because Josh and I were talking about it. If I were to notice that maybe I wasn't making progress in this point where I maybe have gained you know, one or two pounds or just not losing anything at all, a lot of people would look at this and say, damn it, man, I need to lose weight. Like, uh, what is going on? Like, I, I haven't done anything like that. So they take the calories, for example, my 2,500 and chop it right down to 2,000 um, and that's gonna mess up your, you know, it's gonna mess up your metabolism, it's gonna throw you off, and then you're eventually gonna hit a huge plateau because there's not really, you know, you can't really go much further than down to 2,000. At least for me, I wouldn't be able to if I were to take that big of a hit. So um, when Josh and myself were talking, we're like, realistically, all I'd have to do is follow the scientific and calculated approach that we started with, hit my 2,500 calories, be legit, be serious, and then I will be, begin to make progress. So that's what I've been doing and I have been making progress and it's been like super nice. So right now I'm just really getting back on track. I'm 
um, taking things a lot more serious and yeah the main point was just to tell you guys like you know stuff happens and and don't you know you've got to look at the bigger picture and another example is Josh is actually ahead of schedule he just broke down into the um, he just hit 199 a few days ago so he wanted to kind of restore his leptin levels he wanted to do a refeed kind of refuel psychologically and uh, so what he did was he took his calories he increased them significantly high for three days but what he did was instead of just having a ton of fatty foods um, and all that he did a nice calculated approach he increased his carb intake and he had three days of refeed in a row and what happened was uh, he actually made this Facebook post we were talking about it this morning what happened was he went up from 199 uh, by the end of the three days he was at 203 keep in mind a lot of this is bloat and water and uh, and whatnot so but then when he went back to his maintenance calories which was 2700 he experienced a weight loss from 203 down to 198 which was a complete um, a completely new low weigh in and it was just really cool because he kind of wanted to experiment and to see what he could do and and how this refeed would affect him especially since he's ahead of schedule so that's pretty cool and like I said guys just look at the bigger picture if you haven't incorporated refeeds into your routine I highly suggest you do we have a video down below we'll link it and um, it, it, it in a lot of times for people who aren't seeing any progress or stalling this could be the main reason All right, Kyle's officially joining the dark side. So this is uh, this is my first time using like actual fitted knee sleeves. I used Josh's larges before, and they just like slid on. So these are the smalls, and like just took me ten minutes. Extra you guys small, see it. buddy, baby gap. No, they're small. Baby it took me like ten gap. minutes to get them on. Does this look right? I think so. It's just about there. Yeah, you can get a little bit more. I'm struggling with these things, man. All right, so this is a knee sleeve tutorial for you guys and for Kyle. So, what I like to do is fully extend my leg, rip them as far as I can, grab about halfway down, get as much yank as I can. Then from here, I go from the bottom, bunch them up, half roll. It's very uh, systematic, and you're gonna pull it up. This should be able to get to the top of your knee. You lengthen this out, and there you have it, pals. Beauty. I really wish Josh showed me that before I tried putting mine on, but now I know. <laughs> Bro, it works every time, 100% guarantee. It's a secret. <laughs> Okay, so we're doing our squats. Josh has been killing his. I've got 325 on the bar. And I've done uh, three sets. But last week when I was working with 350, uh, I felt a sharp pain, I believe from my biceps, so the bicep connects right into the shoulder blade. Um, I want to guess it's something like along the lines of bicep impingement, but I'm not 100% sure, but safest bet is to go to the doctors. I'm probably gonna end it right here. There's nothing worse than making an injury worse. Like I'm super pissed off, I want to keep going do what I can, summer flex is going well, but just gotta be safe and then see where we can go from there. But it feels, I feel like crap, man. Like I actually wanna cry right now. Like it's actually digging in very deep and it's frustrating, but we'll see what we can do. The worst thing in the world right now is continuing to watch Josh lift while I'm sitting over here um, in pain. It's absolutely killer. Like probably the most pain I've felt in a very, very long time, probably in my life. So it's very smart for me right now to stop, cut it out while I'm still like okay and like it really hurts to even raise my hand up to here like I start to shake so 
I'm gonna go to the doctor and see what they say, but it's a crappy feeling. Man. What? Losing my headphones. Uh, Losing my motivation, that designer Timmy Turner nonsense. Doesn't even fire me up in the first place. Woo! It's way harder doing this after squatting and benching for eight working sets, but we're doing it. Then we're gonna take this kid to the doctor and yeah. All right, so just finished with the doctor. I was told the classic, uh, lower my weights, you know, maybe decrease the amount that I'm working out. I know, summer flex. But anyway, so I am feeling a lot better, which is why I'm happier. Pain has gone down. Um, I did receive some medication, I'll start taking that, but I'm still gonna go in for an ultrasound, see where that takes me, um, and what information I can gather there, and you know, make some decisions from there. But anyways, guys, I really hope you enjoy the video, and we will see you in the next one. I'm out of breath. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Peace. All I do is Every time I'm in the street, I hear yak, 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 yak. Men down.